Mind your decisions, I'm Presh Talwalker. Recently, a test in Singapore is causing a lot of backlash and it even left some students in tears. The test was for 12-year-olds in Singapore and I want to go over one of the more challenging problems and explain how to solve it. Start with five semicircles that are alternatingly up and down. These are the distances between the semicircles. If all five semicircles are identical, what is the diameter of one semicircle? Pause if you'd like to give this problem a try, and when you're ready, keep watching to learn how to solve this problem. There are a couple of ways you can approach the problem. I approached it using algebra. Suppose this distance is x. By symmetry, this distance on the other side of the diagram will also be x. Now label this distance as y, and by symmetry, this distance will also be equal to y. Now let's consider the length of this diameter. It's equal to 22 plus x. Here we'll have another expression for the diameter. It'll be x plus 12 plus y. We have two different ways to express the diameter, so they're equal to each other. We then cancel out the x terms and then simplify this equation. We end up that y is equal to 10. We then focus on the central semicircle and then substitute in for y, and then we get 10 plus 16 plus 10, which gives us our answer that the diameter is equal to 36. This is an algebraic approach, but 12-year-old students would have actually considered a different geometric approach. Let's focus on these two semicircles. Now let's imagine rotating this entire diagram. Notice that this distance will also be equal to 22. Therefore, when we subtract 12 from it, we're left with a distance of 10. The same thing goes for the other two semicircles on the other half of the diagram. We now go back to the original diagram and we focus on the central semicircle. We have 10 plus 16 plus 10, and that again gives us the diameter of 36. Interesting. I think this problem is easy if you know what approach to take, but it would be tricky on a timed exam. Thanks for making Mind Your Decisions one of the best channels on YouTube. As always, thanks for watching and thanks for your support.